Are you looking for a blue for your bedroom? Or maybe you're looking for an accent wall paint color? Or for those of you that have a coastal home, you're just looking for a little bit of pop of color, but you don't want it to be a dark blue like Benjamin Moore Hell Navy, but you don't want it to be too light like Benjamin Moore Ocean Air, then you might want to try out Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue. And when you pair this correctly, it can make your space feel calming, soothing, relaxing, and inviting. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to show you the undertones of Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue, and then I'm going to compare it with some other similar paint colors so that you can see what makes this paint color unique. And I'm going to share with you just a few tips that you should know about Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue. Now watch what happens when I compare this with Benjamin Moore Prentice Cream, which is considered an ivory cream. Watch this. When you compare Prentice Cream with Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue, this is where you're going to see the blue undertone in Santorini Blue. Now watch what happens when I compare this with Benjamin Moore Hell Navy, which is considered a dark navy blue. Watch this. When you compare Benjamin Moore Hell Navy with Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue, this is where you're going to see the blue-gray undertone in Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue. So Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue is what I call a medium dusty blue. It's got just a touch of a gray, and that's what's muting the blue. Next, I'm going to compare it with some other similar dusty blue paint colors to help give you a better idea of what makes this paint color so unique. Now watch what happens when I compare this with Benjamin Moore Van Cortland Blue, which is considered a dusty blue. Watch this. When you compare Benjamin Moore Van Cortland Blue with Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue, you're going to notice how Van Cortland Blue is darker than Santorini Blue, and you're also going to notice how Van Cortland Blue, it leans more on the gray side in comparison to Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue, it leans more on the blue side. Now watch what happens when I compare this with Sharon Williams Stardew, which is considered a dusty blue. Watch this. When you compare Stardew with Santorini Blue, you're going to notice how Stardew is darker than Santorini Blue. But again, notice how Stardew, it leans more on the gray side as Santorini Blue leans more on the blue side. Now watch what happens when I compare this with Benjamin Moore's Water's Edge, which is considered a dusty blue. Watch this. When you compare Water's Edge with Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue, you're going to notice how Water's Edge is darker than Santorini Blue. And you're going to notice how Water's Edge, it leans a little bit more on the gray side in comparison to Santorini Blue. Again, it leans more on the blue side. So what you need to know about Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue is that it's considered a medium dusty blue. It has a tendency to lean more on the blue side. It has just a touch of gray, and that's what's muting the blue. However, like I always say, you've got to get a sample of Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue and compare it with what you have in your home. You need to see, is it going to be clean? Is it going to be muted? Is it going to be lighter? Is it going to be darker? And then in some cases, this paint color can lean a little bit more on the gray side. For example, if you have Benjamin Moore Ocean Air, it's not considered a dusty blue. It's just a light blue. Well, then Santorini Blue, you're definitely going to see a more pronounced gray undertone in Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue. So please compare this with what you have in your home. I want you to get this right. For those of you that are tired of trying sample after sample and you just want to get it right, highly recommend you go to my website and I can help you with both interior or exterior paint colors. You can select any of the online packages and you get a chance to speak to me in a live video call and I can explain to you what will work and what will not work. And then afterwards, you're gonna receive a detailed color kit that's gonna give you the confidence knowing that it doesn't matter which paint colors you select for your home, you know it's gonna work with your fixed elements, your interior decor, and the type of lighting that you receive receive in your home and feel free to read the reviews. I have over 500 reviews. See what clients have to say. I would love to help you. Next, I'm going to share with you just a few tips that you should know about Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue. 
Tip number one, trim paint colors. For those of you that are looking for the perfect warm off white to pair with Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue, I recommend trying out Sharon Williams Pure White. It's a beautiful warm off white, and when you compare this with Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue, it pairs and contrasts beautifully with Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue. Tip number two, kitchen accent color. For those of you that painted your kitchen cabinets with Benjamin Moore Ballet White and you're looking for a kitchen island paint color, highly recommend to try out Benjamin Moore Santorini Blue. It pairs and contrasts beautifully with Benjamin Moore Ballet White. It's going to create that calming, soothing ambiance that you're looking for in your kitchen. If you found this video helpful, please put a like. I would love to hear from you. And for those of you that want to get in-depth paint color reviews that you can't find anywhere else, highly recommend you to subscribe to this channel. I would love to have you here. Thank you for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.